y'all hey and welcome back to the channel today we are going to be doing some traditional red candy apples here I have a unprepped apple as you can see it is shiny and a pretty green I am also going to show you a prepped apple that has been put in boiling water baking soda and apple cider vinegar and here is my prepped apple as you can see the discoloration in the apple we have stripped this apple of all wax so it is wax free it has sat for 24 hours and ready to be dipped all right guys my camera's not focusing the way it should but here i have some banana cream Lorianne's flavoring this is what i'm going to be flavoring my candy with today add your flavoring once your temp reaches 250. okay so i am going to be using my chef masters white gel food coloring and i am going to be using a super red from americolor All right guys, so let's go ahead and pop our thermometer in on the side and go ahead and place our candy mixture on the stove. All right guys, I have removed my candy from the stove. I am going to remove my thermometer. I always let my temperature of my candy reach 300 before I remove it. I remove my thermometer. I always stir to make sure everything is well incorporated and until my bubbles have subsided and then I begin to dip. All right guys, it's the shine for me. I can see myself in these apples as if I'm looking in a mirror. A old time hack for getting the glassy look for your candy apples is adding one cap of white distilled vinegar. After prepping your apples, remember to always let them sit for 24 to 48 hours so they will be bubble free. All right, guys, there's the end result. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And like always, thanks for watching.